Hey, here we are at the top of Prospect Mountain in Lake George, New York. It's definitely an iconic location for the region. Um, at 2,030 feet at the summit, it's said to have a 100-mile view in all directions of the Adirondacks, and it's just absolutely breathtakingly beautiful. I had so much fun on this afternoon. I really wanted to share it One, with everyone. Two. Hello. Hi. This is me hiking. Up on Prospect Mountain. Now, we drove up. It was myself, my mom, and a good family friend, Jim Corrigan. So, on the drive up, there's multiple different stopping sites where you can get out. Get out of the car, you know, take some pictures, have a nice view, stuff like that. Um, it's a 5.5 mile drive up, but lots of scenic things to check out, especially during the nice fall foliage. I hope you really get a chance to take it in in this video because it was just so beautiful that day. Now, it's normally $10 a car to get to the summit of the mountain, but what I did in the spring this year was just fill out forms if you have a disability. You can fill out forms to get an all-access pass to all New York State Parks. So that was really awesome. And basically, if you have um, a handicap access pass, then you can drive right to the top of the mountain instead of taking a shuttle. And all these little pavilions and picnic tables and little grills are available for you to have a little luncheon outing, which is really neat. Actually, I misspoke a little bit right there. You don't need an all-access pass to be able to drive to the top. You just need your little handicap marker. Okay. Are you going to do another one? Hey, so we're at the top of Prospect Mountain in Lake George, and it's a nice, crisp fall day. Getting out is exciting. Um, really wanted to do this because I feel like I've been self-defeating a lot lately, wanting like the vlog and everything to be so perfect that, yeah, I'm getting in my way a little bit about it, so I just wanted to grow some balls and get myself out there a little bit, and just do a little video about outings and adventures and stuff like that. Beautiful fall day. Able to still hike and get out. So yeah, let's get some feedback on this. Can anyone relate? Like sometimes I want something to be so perfect that it keeps me from even doing it in the first place. And then also there's times where I want to be like so outgoing and strong, independent female, putting myself out there, showing other people with my disability that, you know, you can still do it and um, be, a, you know, the misrepresentative of spinal cord injury and everything like that. And then there's other times that I just want to curl up and hide in my room. Can anyone relate to this? Clearly, this was just such a beautiful day that I wanted to share it with everybody. You'll see in this next clip, it even had me singing. Benny, 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 Benny and the Jets. Go, 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 Benny, go, Benny. <laughs> doing all right. It's steep, but I'm okay. I still hike. Come out here, bitches. So here would be a perfect place for a curb cut. I'm able to get on a lot of the pathways, but here to reach the summit, really like one of the nicest parts. There's really no accessibility spot and it's pretty unlevel. But we were able to creep up on the road. Just watch out for tour buses. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Okay. So to get back to seriousness, everything isn't always going to be perfect. It's really kind of difficult um, to shoot video myself, especially when I put it in this program. It cuts out a lot of it. But you know what? I did it and I had a great time that day and I'm happy I put myself out there. 
When we went home to keep in the fall theme of things, I had been craving butternut squash soup. So we went home and roasted um, a bunch of sweet potatoes and butternut squash. While those were roasting, I sauteed onions, garlic, ginger, carrots, and fresh apples. I love these tubes of pre-grated ginger that you can get at the grocery store. Um, it saves a lot of time and um, it's nice and fresh and has wonderful flavor still. So it's really just a time saver. Um, otherwise than that, what did I put in there? I had, I used chicken stock. I deglazed with a little apple cider juice, cinnamon, nutmeg, allspice, um, and just once the squash and butternut were roasted, I just scooped it right out of its shell, so no need for peeling, dicing, or chopping. It was a really good time saver to just roast it like that. That way, you know, sometimes butternut squash can be a big pain to kind of get the skin off it and chop it. It's a lot of manual work. So it was nice that we roasted it, and it came out super delicious and yummy. Definitely um, an awesome fall day. So... So I hope you guys get a chance to check out some parks if you have any questions, what it entails to get the disability pass or what it's like to visit Lake George, New York or a recipe for butternut squash soup. Feel free to hit me up. Thanks, guys.